Welcome back into the news hour where we have a fresh edition of Foodie Friday. This week, we stayed in Salisbury to head to a staple in the community, Market Street Inn. Take a look. Welcome to another episode of Foodie Friday. This week, we're in Salisbury at Market Street Inn where time after time after time again, they serve really good food and we're excited to try them out. Let's go. Market Street Inn in Salisbury is a staple, but like everyone else, they've had to adapt to a new way of life during the pandemic. Every other booth, we've taped them off. Uh, we've got hand sanitizing stations at each bathroom entrance, the entrance to coming in and out of outside. Um, we've also put in a new floor in the pub so it's better to clean. One thing that hasn't changed, though, is their executive chef, Phil Hitch, who's known for making mouth-watering dishes. But his protege, Stu White, is also blowing people away with his food. You know, I put a lot of love in my dishes and I try to make sure there's to perfection. Not try to make sure, I'm going to make sure it's perfection. Now that I stand on that. We actually met Stu earlier this year at Warwick's Culinary School on another Foodie Friday shoot. And he tells us that Market Street has been the perfect place to apply what he's learned in school and pair that with what his friend and mentor, Chef Phil, has taught him. Like I said, we talk, not just here, outside of work. You know, I might text him and ask him questions and stuff like that. You know, he'll never hold back. You know, he just tell me, give it to me like it is. So. Together, Phil and Stu combined to make a dynamic duo. And for us, they whipped up three amazing dishes. A Mediterranean salad with grilled shrimp, a pork tenderloin over a bed of couscous and asparagus, and last but certainly not least, a Korean fried chicken sandwich, which Stu gave very high praise to. I feel like you're going to like that chicken sandwich. That chicken sandwich? Hey, listen, because <laughs> I ain't going to lie. Uh -huh. I'll be looking at that joint. I'll be like, good, that's a good <laughs> sandwich. It looks so good. And he wasn't wrong. The sandwich is a work of art. Look at the size. I mean, look at the size of that thing. That's half of my face in one sandwich. <laughs> the chicken is deep fried and features a sweet and spicy sauce, crispy onions, and a slaw that helps cut through everything. But how did it taste? All right, so just go in for it. Go in for it. All right, all right here we go. A little uh, cucumber and carrot slaw. Mmm. We got sweet, spicy. Well, let's just say midway through tasting it, I lost track of what Chef Phil was saying and started dreaming of having more of his chicken sandwiches. So with that being said, you know what I had to say. That chicken sandwich, downtown delicious, baby. Downtown delicious. Woo! But of course, the chicken sandwich wasn't the only amazing dish we got to try. The Mediterranean salad was no pushover either. The grilled romaine lettuce, grilled shrimp paired with tomatoes and olive relish, all coming together to make a dish that is simply delicious, with a dressing that perfectly caps it all off. It's like an herb grimlata. Um, it's like parsley, lemon zest, uh, a little garlic, and we use a uh, little EVOO, and uh, a balsamic reduction. You guys give so much that you could split it. It is something you, that you date share. With a family or something Ooh. like that is a nice, nice appetizer, or if you're really hungry, you could have that as an entree by yourself. Oh yeah. And be really full. Last but not least, though, we had to try Stu's special, his pork tenderloin. To make it, Stu uses a spice rub and then finishes it off with his own red wine sauce. The dish is served with couscous made with tarragon, parsley, and lemon juice, as well as asparagus. And people, my goodness. Dude, be honest there. You kidding me? Uh, you kidding me? <laughs> We got it with it. It's delicious, man. Hey, that's what I'm talking Come about. Come on man. now. Hey, Come on now. About, so don't play with me, man. <laughs> the pork is tender and juicy. The red wine sauce adds a nice bitter sweet note. And the couscous and asparagus are the perfect companions. Just like Market Street Inn is the perfect place to grab a bite. Now, if you'd like to try Market Street Inn for yourself, they're located at 130 West Market Street in Salisbury. Of course, if you go, let them know that you saw them on Foodie Friday.